today we are going to be doing the biggest opening we have done yet 1500 large gift bags in one sitting this is worth over 20 million diamonds we're going to open all of these gift bags and i'm going to tally up each item and every gem we get to see if we actually break even or even make a profit from opening these large gift bags you guys showed some amazing support on the last video about the regular gift bags so i just thought naturally let's try it with the large ones now it took me forever to buy this many large gift bags people don't sell them in bulk very often so i had to individually buy these in little bundles so this took a long time so if you enjoyed the video please like it subscribe to the channel and comment your username down below for the exclusive giveaway every single video we give away three exclusive pets so make sure you comment down below to be entered in all you have to do is be subscribed to the channel Without further ado, we are going to get right into it because we have so many gift bags to open. Okay, you guys, so we've cleared out our diamonds as well as all of the items in our inventory. All we have left is these untradeable stuff, so we'll know exactly what we get from these 1,500 gift bags. As you can see, we also have no potions, no enchants, so everything from these three tabs will be exactly what we get from the gift bags. At the very end, I'll tally up and let you know exactly how much each gift bag we opened was worth, and then we'll know whether or not it's worth it to just open these or sell them in the trading plaza. So as you guys can see here, these are worth 25.5 million diamonds, guys. This is such a big opening. I really hope we actually profit from this because this is going to be a very expensive loss if we do not get a profit. Similar to the last video, I'm going to open up 500 at a time. Just sped up and we are going to see exactly what we get. Hopefully after the first 500, we are in profit. Let's do it. I accidentally opened the bundle of toys. We gotta we gotta click slowly at first while it's adding the new stuff. I think we I think we actually just got two charm stones in a row from gift bags. That was actually crazy. So uh, we were a hundred gift bags in and we're actually already three charm stones in. Okay, you guys, so we are done with the first 500, so we can do a little checkup to see exactly what we got so far. We're at a total of 18 charm stones, so that's a good amount of those. We only have six lucky blocks. We actually got 37 of these gift bags, which is interesting from the last video. Okay, so off the bat, this one is looking a lot more rough than the regular gift bag opening that we did yesterday. These 500 large gift bags totaled 8.5 million in cost for us to open. So we're looking to make at least 8.5 million from what we've got so far. We have 4.74 million in diamonds, about 1.8 million in charm stones. I'm not going to lie, you guys, this one is not looking nearly as good. It looks like we are down a lot. We spent 8.5 million. I don't I, I know a lot of these things add up. So we're going to find out in the final tally. We're not super ahead like we were with the regular gift bags from yesterday. But I think once we add everything up, we are going to be pretty close to even or a little above. But we're going to keep going. I'm going to do another 500 and then we'll check in and do another little update. So I'll be right back. All right, and 500. Okay, so one thing I did not consider before was we are actually opening a lot of these crystal key parts. So this is actually worth a lot. As you guys know, we can combine these keys and sell them for an even bigger amount. So we are little, we are a little higher in profit than I thought. Uh, because I didn't see other any other big items, but yes, these are worth a lot, so that's something to consider. Because I know it's going to take forever to do the math, I'm actually going to start opening the last of them, just so we could get this done, and I could see if we're actually making profit, because it's actually, it's killing me, I really want to know. I think we are, I still think we're in profit, it's just too hard to tell with how many different items we actually have. Alright, so I'll see you in a second.
Okay, guys, we are finally done. This is the final inventory that we have after opening everything. So off the bat, we have 43 charm stones, totaling 4.5 million diamonds worth. We also have enough parts to make 36 crystal keys, so that is pretty significant as well. We have 56 TNT crates, 34 lucky blocks worth 766k. 32 fortune flags, 109 regular gift bags. You guys know I'm going to open this after the video. We got a total of 470 diamond flags, so that is a lot. 1260 TNT worth 425k. For the potion section, we actually didn't get anything too crazy, it looks like. We just got pretty much the regular potions. These don't seem to be worth all that much. Maybe these tier 2 potions when stacked up, they could be worth a lot. Like 141k right here, 128k in coins potion 2s. And then on to the enchant. The highest level that you can get from these gift bags are the level 5 books. Then we got a whole 14.4 million diamonds just from opening these bad boys. So, we need a total of around 10 million diamonds worth of items so hopefully all of these items adds up to at least 10 million and then we broke even for the video if not we are probably going to get a big loss i think with the addition of these crystal keys i'm going to combine them because the value is better when you combine them uh as you can see it's 34k compared to 24k if you just sell them in the parts so we're going to combine these and that's going to add a little bit of value uh, I don't know if that's cheating, but that's what you guys should be doing. Definitely do not sell your crystal keys in parts. So I'm going to be back in a little bit after I do these calculations and we'll see if we actually made a profit. Okay, guys, it took me forever again, but I did the math and I added up all the items, all the potions, all the enchants that we got from opening 1,500 large gift bags, and I have the results. I was actually surprised by this. I thought we were on the break, like, I thought we were just breaking even, but we actually managed to get a profit from opening these. Now, it's not as significant as the regular gift bags, but... At the end of the day, it's still a profit. So, so first I'll show you that I did write down each and every item that we got from opening these bags. As you guys can see, I have everything written. You can go back in the video and check to make sure I have this right. But this is all the quantities of everything we opened. Next to it is the current wrap value of those items. And then next to that is the total value of everything added up. All right, to make it easier to read, I went through and highlighted a few of the expensive things that we opened. So we got a grand total of 14.4 million in value just from the items that we opened so at the top of that list is obviously the charm stones we got 43 of those totaling at 4.42 million that is a lot of charm stones i might be bringing down the charm stone economy after these last two videos so i'm sorry about that for the people that own charm stones next we have the lucky blocks which was 765,000. Crystal keys were actually more than that at 1.25 million. This is after I combined all the, the parts we had. The bag of toys is 513,000. Regular gift bags, we got 447,000. And then finally, we have TNT totaling 425,000. So that's some of the big things. And then obviously, we got the 4.4 million worth of diamonds open. So combine that for a total overall value of 28.8 million from the opening. We basically earned a 3.3 million in profit from doing this opening. Uh, as you can see here, 3.3 million. This represents a 12 or uh, round up to a 13% profit. So it's nothing like too crazy, but it definitely seems like it is worth it to open these rather than go through the trouble of selling them. And if you buy enough of these, it might just be worth it for you guys. So it might be something to look out for if you're trying to flip some diamonds and make a quick buck. And then lastly, the last number we have here is the value per bag. So... Of the 1,500 bags that I opened, I got roughly 19,208 diamonds per bag. And the current wrap value is about 17,000 exactly, I'm pretty sure. So 
that is a good little margin that you can get. I personally, I'd probably buy them if they were anywhere 18,000 or less in the plaza. So that is a good point for me. But the, the, the profit margin really is not that significant. I'm just glad that we overall made a profit because I was really scared. This was the last of my diamonds. It was such an expensive video. It's actually amazing that you can just get profit by opening these things. I always thought that the plaza was giving you a better price than actually opening them. I'm overall a happy camper about this. If you want to know the results from tests that I do like this, please join the Discord down in the description. My Discord community hears the results of these tests before I post them in the videos. So if you want the inside scoop and stuff I'm currently testing, go join the Discord now and you will be notified of these things. Remember to comment your Roblox username down below to be entered into the giveaway for this video. And comment any more ideas you guys have for videos as I take all suggestions. I really enjoy the videos that involve numbers and doing tests. So if you have a good idea for something that I could test in game, please leave it down below and I'll see you later. Peace out.